Welcome to the easiest roof mission in Bangkok. Step one, drive right in front of the front door. All the way. Step two, walk into the back alley. Step three, there's an open door. Go in. Step four, walk up the stairs. You guys go, go, go. Step five, enjoy your very own rooftop as your heart desires and do some parkour. Anan and I have been up here countless times because it's... Because I ran out of fingers. <laughs> <laughs> However, for Zen and Kazuma, it's the first time. Yeah, it's very yeah. nice. Very warm too. Are you nervous for your first time? Of course, yes. I'm scared about the filming. <laughs> my weekly video. <laughs> Today we're shooting another Zen rooftop edit. So let's talk a little bit about filmmaking. The most fascinating thing for me today is the sheer amount and diversity of Kazuma's cameras. Quick camera tour. Okay, wait, 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 wait. What what do you use each camera for? I usually use this VHS shit shit camera. <laughs> Is that the official name? Shit camera? Shit camera. <laughs> Where did you get it from? My mom's boat. Family camera. Family camera. Home video. Why do you use it? This this seems it's like a better camera. Looks shit, but it's nice for me. Nice <laughs> for me. I like weird. What is what is this? Uh, this is 3D camera. Uh, it's difficult for explain. But Nishika, Nishika camera. Nishika, is mm. it famous? It's famous. So you can see it has four lenses. It's also all the camera. And it shoots on film? Yes. So you get four images and they're all slightly different angle. Yeah, at one time. And then you make the animation? Yeah, GIF. GIF? And it's a cool effect. You call it GIF? 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 GIF. GIF. Even the English GIF. don't know. GIF. It's, a, it's an age-old discussion. Yes. Next one. The film. Film camera. Minolta? Minolta. What do you use this one for? Parkour shot or my friend's trip. Trip. I've never seen I this don't. camera before. GoPro Hero 6. Use it for? Mm, POV, parkour. Mm -hmm. That's all. Oh, and this guy? This is... It looks beautiful. So, nature or uh, slow mo, what I want to. Mm -hmm. Most modern camera. Yes. Okay. Most Which beautiful. Uh, beautiful. Shit, shit. And you like to mix it, right? Yeah. <coughs> I just experiment. Mm -hmm. Do some experiments. I just want to do fun things. Mm -hmm. I think just it looks really like cool. Thank you. So, let's put them in the order, oldest to newest. Ah, uh, okay. Here... This oh, actually, this probably older, my huh? grandfather. This is your grandfather's, yeah, grandfather's camera. camera. So, oldest. Where did, where did you... Shimada is almost ready to go. Oh, it's actually funny, Kazuma and Zen both have the same last name, Shimada. But off topic, I'm really excited for uh, what uh, Kazuma is going to film and seeing the camera he uses makes me a little bit envious because it's something I want to play with a little bit. But I feel like it's we had the 
the chance to shoot some Tokyo single eight, so it was really fun. Maybe we get to do it later on, but it's kind of crazy. Now everything I do is so like, film it and upload it the same day, film it and upload it the same day. I'm excited at some point to switch into the kind of a different mode and get a little bit more hipstery with the cameras. Zen is doing another shot. <laughs> it's so hot. So sweaty. <laughs> That's why you just never take it off. That's the technique. Never take it off. Right now I'm getting a gimbal shot of Zen's little action line. The most dangerous thing when doing this is that, for one, you've got to really focus on getting the shot good while always keeping in the back of your mind that there is a death drop inches behind you and you gotta kinda make sure you never get too close. But you also wanna be far back to get the good shot. So yeah, knock on wood. Now let's hear your plan. Nice. Oh, finally. Yeah, first try, bitch. <laughs> Sunset, but then this one fucking cloud decides to fuck up our last 30 minutes of shooting. <laughs> Did it work? Yeah. It's still there! <laughs> it works a little bit. <laughs> As usual, while we're shooting these videos, I can't really show you much of the action that we're gonna put in the final video. But I want to explain to you real quick how we kind of choreograph and then choose the right angle for an action line that we're going to shoot. And uh, kind of that analogy that makes me think about it is a gymnastics coach I used to know. And she had one of her students who had a really shitty handstand. And whenever she had to do her routine, if you looked at her handstand from the side, you could see that it was totally not upright. But she would always plan the routine so when the judges saw her handstand they would always see the handstand from this angle so from that angle you can't really tell whether it is a crooked handstand or it is a straight handstand and that kind of describes how we try to help our athletes to look the best or ourselves to look the best when shooting a parkour video right because there are some tricks that only look good from a certain angle a side flip will look really great if shot from this side you can see my face my body the body shape i'm making but if you're on the other side i mean i have a pretty beautiful ass so it's okay but uh it's not as flattering as my face so whenever we plan a line, we always usually try to see for each trick in that line, what's the perfect uh, position to shoot that trick and how do I get from that position to that position in the most pretty way. And a lot of times it's simply not possible. So we kind of have a back and forth where I will usually, um, the cameraman will say, hey, come up with your favorite line. And then we'll choreograph the whole action line 
and while then figuring out the camera movement we might switch out a few tricks just because they don't look good from that angle and uh, that is how we kind of make everything look good so a run that we would do in a video a lot of times is not a run that we would necessarily do in training because uh, we care a lot about looking good in public but don't give a fuck what people think but make yourself look good on camera so anyway uh, that's a little insight on how we shoot and I hope as soon you get to see some more of those examples when we actually finish these videos yeah some pretty sick uh, whoa Zen did some pretty badass shit today we had the honor of capturing it I'm excited to shoot soon my foot is slowly getting better uh, I'm gonna see you soon. subscribe or something like that <laughs>